think Kylie Jenner the highest paid celebrity? What? <laughs> oh, that's that little baby thing. What does yeah, that mean? Just, I'm saying five hundred. Oh, that's what it is. Okay, yeah. All right. So he said two hundred k, but five hundred million. You know what, Scotty? I never. You just taught me something. I never knew what people be doing this in the comments. So that's what that means. Okay, yeah. got you. All right. So yeah, she making. So, but Kylie is getting paid. Let's be correct. Five hundred million. Right. Kylie is the highest paid celebrity in the world. And behind her was um, Kanye West and LeBron James and a few other people. Uh, I'm going to pull up the article. But when I was talking to Scotty about it, I was like, Scotty, like, how in the world is Kylie Jenner? She's had, she's 20, how old is she? 23? At the most, 23, a 23-year-old girl that has not been in the game for a long time and surpassing yes, black 40-year-old men <laughs> that has been in the game for a long time. Yeah. Like, what is that? Is that privilege or is that hard work? Because I need to know. What y'all think? What you, why you, what you think? I'm going to pull up the article while you say what you think. Honestly, I'm kind of biased about this because... I'm not biased. You're a Kylie fan. No, I wasn't about to say I'm biased. No, I am a Kylie fan, but I feel as though the platform that Kylie got is the platform that everybody needs. Like, at the end of the day, she has people from all over the world buying her product. Those men cannot kind of say that. You know, they have those type of accomplishments, but she has social media. She's social media. You know, like, she literally has showed the way that you can fully just accomplish so, like, just, I don't know. That market is just so huge. Like, do you see how many followers she has? She has such well, a huge you, market where she just produces product and they're going to buy it. So she's Well, just, you know what they say, though, Scotty. What? That they be lying about how much money they make. Yeah, I did hear that too. I did hear that too. So a lot of this stuff be publicity stunts because I really have Is a hard accurate? time. Is it accurate this time? That's what Satire said. Yeah, they did say that. I really have a hard time <clears throat> believing oh, that. that? If, if, this is um, the thing. I need to know who is the guy. Who is the Okay, man? I got you. I got you. Oh, got you. All right. So, uh-oh, when I tapped it, it moved. <laughs> the what? It moved it. All right. When I tapped the screen, it moved the screen I was on. All right. So it says that <laughs> top earning celebrities were Kylie Jenner and Kanye West. Kylie Jenner was at fifty. Was at five hundred and ninety million, and Kanye West was at one hundred and seventy million. Do you see that gap? Even that's the fact that that's like that's like four hundred million dollars. Okay, all right, so I'm gonna name who else is on the list. So, uh, it's talking too much. Okay, Kylie Jenner is number one, Kanye West is number two, Roger Federner, Federner, I don't know what he does. That's number three, Kristen Rolando, don't know what he does either. Um, Lionel Messi, don't know who that is either. These look like actually look like soccer players. Can you see that? I think they're soccer players. I don't know. Tyler Perry is number six with 97 million. But let's talk about that, though. Tyler Perry been in the game for, like, 15 years. Yeah, you know, like, how is this young girl? That's privilege, Scotty. That's what that's that is. Privilege. It's privilege. It's definitely privilege. I mean, it's privilege is on so many different ends, and I don't want to get too deep into it. So Tyra know everything. She said he's a tennis player. I don't watch tennis, so I don't know what better is a tennis. Sorry, player. but well, I just I don't um, know because I just I just on, let me, the I'm, platform let me is so finish. huge. Let me finish. Let me finish. Um. Neymar is at, don't know who that is either. He looks like a, a sports player too. He's at 95 million. Howard Stern, know who that is. 
he is at 90 million. LeBron James is at 88 million. And Dwayne Johnson is at 87 million. Okay, so. Where's LeBron? LeBron James is number nine. Oh. That's top 10 right there. But where is Beyonce? Where is Rihanna? Where is Jay Z at? Well, I don't know how accurate this list is. What is that? The Forbes list? This is the Forbes list. The highest paid celebrities Forbes list. Tracy said because it's because ACL is Black Hollywood. Rihanna in there, like I just don't understand how somebody. What is it based off of Tyler? What do? Okay, is it right. based off of how much that one business, or is it just... The top earning celebrities were... Oh. The world's highest paid celebrities earned a combined a combined amount of $6.1 billion before taxes. Wow. All right. A $200 million drop from 2019 after the global pandemic shuttered stadiums and silenced performances around the world. The decline was the first since 2016, the year after Floyd Mayweather and Manny Pacquiao, oh, I remember that, earned their first half a billion dollars between them from the richest fight in boxing history. But even with COVID-19 lurking and America on fire in every scene of the work, in every sense of the word, following the murder of George Floyd, the show still went on. The top earning celebrities was Kylie Jenner, Kanye West. Okay. Um, West collected most of his earnings from his Yeezy sneakers deals with Adidas, while Kylie Jenner's payday came from selling a 51% stake in her cosmetics firm to Cody in January. While she had an exaggerated, while she had exaggerated over the years about the size of her business, that's the part too. Because I don't know if you heard about that. Exactly. The Cody, huh? Uh -huh. What about the Cody deal? The Cody deal, like they said that, like it was all. Um, I read an article when she first sold it. They were kind of disappointed because they thought that she was making more than what she was presenting herself to make. So they pretty much was they lost out pretty much, like honestly, that her product wasn't when they, as, when they invested in the company. Yeah, so pretty much Kylie did good because she marketed herself correctly, you know, and they did. They didn't do what they're supposed to do because y'all should have researched, you know, like y'all should have. And then <laughs> Cyrus said that lip gloss is not that good. I, Scotty, you got it, don't you? Well, oh, it's not. It's just too metified for me, honestly. Like, I would, I bought two and I was out. I mean, I wouldn't, mm, no. It's enough. So you, so, so, so you said you don't think it's privileged. I mean, I can see where it can be privileged, but I do. I mean, I guess social media is also always, you know, a fluke. That too. That's what you have to be careful with. That. It didn't make. Now it's no, it's no denying on like social media business and um, social media e-commerce, like. <gasps> Where is that? Okay, Nick's Nick's period. 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 Oh, that. <laughs> Nick's period. Pieces. Period. Hey, see. So well, what y'all think? Tell me what y'all think. So sorry, yeah, what do y'all think? Do y'all think? Do y'all think? We just said fifty artifact? fifty. Huh? Quit. Quit. said fifty fifty. She. Do y'all even think the article is true? Like, I have issue agreeing with the article in the first place because it's no way. You, Rihanna, where is Rihanna? Well, I where think is we're, Rihanna? Like, Rihanna definitely needs to be. Rihanna has everything. She has a makeup line. She has a lingerie line. She has a high end fashion line. Where is she? Be right back, guys. So I'm just trying to figure that out. I don't know. Me personally, I think it's white privilege. I didn't want to get into racism, but I'd be scared. I'd be trying to, you know, not get too deep into stuff. But I think it is it's white privilege and um, 
rich privilege at the end of the day. Because ain't no way a 23-year-old girl is making more, or even if that is the case, it shouldn't be the case. That's sad that that's the type of world that we live in right now. That a 23-year-old girl is that is, has only been making money or only been had her cosmetics line for maybe, what, five years at the most? is making more than what a black man then work his whole life and get, she he still ain't amount to what she making and that's that's pretty sad that's very very sad thank y'all for agreeing with me my co-host that left me out in the dust so 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 the um so the people that tune in, what do y'all think? What do y'all think that the list is true? Number one and number two, do you think that Kylie deserves that? Is that privilege or is that something that you think she worked hard for and busted her ass to get or what? I'm sorry, y'all. Okay. Okay. Sorry. Because I would love to know. Hey, Devin. What was the question? I, I said, so I asked them to let us know what they think. Like, what do you think? Do you think Kylie deserves it? Like, that she worked her ass off to get to where she is and to make 500 to be worth that much money? Or, and do you think, do you think the list is even accurate? My answer to both is no. No, it's not accurate and no, she don't deserve it. Cece said the Kardashians don't deserve anything. I'm sick of their ass. Well, you know, okay, look, and, and I'm gonna even say this too. The I fact that she like people are catching up. Huh? I feel like at this point people are catching up and the trend is slowing down. But you have to agree, at one time they had a very huge impact. No, I will say this. Now I used to be the biggest Kim Kardashian fan, and I still like Kim Kardashian. That girl work hard. Yeah. She do work hard. But the fact that she's even been working for 15 years and she ain't even worked with Kylie Word. I don't, it's something up with that, y'all. It just don't even, that don't even add up. It don't make sense. Do you think it does not make sense? Her name to be on Forbes, like they say Cardi B bought her Grammy? Yeah, sometimes when you do stuff like that, you make yourself seem more than what it actually is. Mm hmm What, what is she, what, who's the, she made her money because she sold part of her. Yeah, but still. Yeah, that's what they said. They didn't she said that in the article? Is that where she Yeah, said? they said that she her sold her company, company. How much did she sell her company for? I, I, it was a lot. Like that's prob that's probably what it is. I think it was probably like five hundred million. That's probably okay, well yeah, that that probably is what it is. Yeah. But that's a bad business deal on their end because their pro her product is not even that good. I think somebody said that Fenty is better. I saw that come up. Yeah, Sasara said that Fenty is better. Okay. Fenty is definitely better. Well, I've never even I've never even used uh Kylie cosmetics. And what she all she got is lipstick, right? She don't even have like foundation. Does she have foundation? Um yeah, she does. She have like she's expanded a lot. Foundation, skincare. Oh wow! See, I didn't know she had foundation. I didn't know that. When did she come out with foundation? She has like a whole line. Like, so what do you line. think? What do you think about Kanye West being number two? And that's a little weird too. How is Kanye West number two? Did they pay like the fact that they're top two? You know, like they're right. still connected. That's, to make, each other, that's what like, makes it sense. That's what make it a little sus because it's like, come on now. And it probably is bought, just like the freaking Grammys. Like, everybody say that, you know, even the, you know, Grammys. I'm getting to the point where I don't believe nothing until I see it. Like, with my own eyes, especially in today's Show society. Me. Huh? Said, Show me the money on the table. That's what I'm saying. Uh, especially in today's society, everything is a facade. Everything it is, is a so fake. Like, I don't believe flex anything until I see it. Huh? So they be flexed out. Flexed out. Flexed out. But I do think, like, LeBron James and stuff deserve it. Yeah. I think LeBron. 
LeBron, Brian. I thought LeBron, no, LeBron be making a lot of money. That's what I'm saying, Scotty. And where, uh, once again, where is Beyonce and where is Jay Z? But Beyonce been kind of low key. I was say she didn't do a lot this year. Like that Ivy Park. Okay, let's talk about that. What the backlash? Okay, and, and we can talk about that too. First of all, how do you feel about Ivy Park? How do you feel about the clothes? I don't really look at them. I'm gonna be honest. But I love Beyonce. You know she likes that. I love Beyonce, but you know what? And I'm not a business connoisseur or anything like that, but I really feel like she should have gave that torch to Solange and said, hey, look, Solange, start your own fashion line, and I will invest in it. Like, I feel like Beyonce should have given Solange money to open up her, to start her own brand, because Solange actually has, like, a style. Beyonce ain't never been no style icon, you know? Yeah, and yeah, to be honest, House of Darion was a hit, no cheap. That shit was Tried to make it work. Tried to make it work. I mean, I'm not crazy yeah. about Ivy Park stuff. Like, some of it be looking cute, but you don't really see people wearing that on an everyday basis. What, House of Darius? But it's in Nordstrom, so she making money. Okay, Tracy. Not Tracy. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> yeah, that's I don't care for it either. I don't like it. I don't like it at all. It's too baggy. It's like... It's just, I think Solange can dress CC. I think Solange can dress. I don't really think Solange can dress either. She a little too... I think she... I think she will sell better than Beyonce do. Honestly. I think... Y'all, I think Solange can dress. I like it. But... What about the backlash of the two girls? Oh, yeah. That Were was they crazy. Russian or something? Yeah, but it was like, who even set y'all up to do that photo shoot? Like, who idea was that? And it's so crazy that people love our culture so freaking much that they will die to dress like us, but then be so scared <laughs> about every day. Hold on. I'm sorry, Scotty. I'm laughing at I'm laughing at um, <laughs> Tracy said her fashion is too earthy. Solange. Oh, <laughs> this is that two free people ish. Oh, I like it. I think it's 24 cute. 24 7. I think it's cute. 24 7. But, but you, you said like, what? You said like I was saying, everybody want to love our culture, want to sit up there and think that it's a photo shoot content idea to dress like us, be black face, and then retor return back to your normal white life. It don't go like that. Like, we're not no fucking, like, that was, that was crazy to me. And when I heard that, I listened to it on impress, Impressive. And I was like, I know good and well Beyonce didn't approve of this. And I was like, it Girl, just Girl, I love Scotty. The Impressive channel, she needs to. It had me. to just creep through the nooks and crannies because it's not a way. That was out of line. The girl. No, but that right there, that right there. there. Right there. They were popping huh? freaking in the video. I saw it. <laughs> but that right there tell you, Scotty, how how uninvolved you think your celebrity, your favorite right. celebrity, and all of so, that they got up say so. Right. They're so uninvolved. Right. They're so uninvolved with the shit they giving us. They out there living their own life while we running after everything they throwing at us, and it ain't even really them. They just got people. They hired people to give it to us. Yeah, you're right. Because ain't no way Beyonce is gonna approve, approve that something shit. like that. <laughs> she wouldn't how? approve that shit. How did how did that make it that far? Cause them, and not only that, they looked a hot mess. I can see they look good. You said who? Huh? You said what? I said, and not only that, they looked a hot mess. I can see if they actually look good. They didn't even look good. Both tacky. Angry. They look a mess. Their hair was a mess. Throw, throw back. They look a that. hot Hella. mess. Look at and I, I love free people. You shall do queen to queen. I like free people and I like Solange. So I don't, yeah, I don't understand why degree. everybody hating on Solange right yeah, now. I, I do. It's 24 is, seconds. I mean, have y'all, okay, hold on, wait. I got to pull up some Solange pictures. I got to defend what I'm saying. Because Solange can dress to me. That's just my personal opinion. So who who do you think need to come out with a with a fashion line that has not, Scotty? Um... Celebrity wise, you know Rihanna had Fenty, but there she wasn't hitting no. <laughs> you said what? Rihanna had the Fenty. You know the 
wasn't it the workout gear? That was with Puma, I think, right? Puma, right. But she has an actually fancy high end line too. Do she? Um, who do I think? I gotta remind y'all. I got. I think I have to remind y'all of the line. Huh? This is Zendaya. Yeah, she's great. I like Zendaya. I'm tired of the Instagram. I love the Instagram thought style. Don't get me wrong. I love that style. But that's not fashion. I feel like everybody is into the the thought style now. I like... So you think Solange can dress? I do think Solange can dress. I do. I think Solange can dress. I like the way the little girl from Black is dressed. Um, who else? Right. Who else do I like? Oh yeah. Huh? That's it. I know you. Oh, I like the way Lori Harvey dressed. I like the way. My phone. Sometimes my phone. I said I like the way Lori Harvey dressed. Oh, yeah. I love the way Lori Harvey dressed. I love the way. What about Tiana Taylor? Not really. She a little too. Tomboy. <laughs> Warrior status. Like, just video game. Like, she's about to play a bit. Like, she's involved in a video game. Mm. Oh, you know who? Oh, I already told you. I like Emily B. Yeah, Emily B can dress. I like how Emily. I love the way Emily B dress. I just hate. But I like the way her daughter does too. Yes. I like the way what's her name? La Tiana or something? Tiana? Tatiana? Tiana. Yeah. I, I I like her. I do like her. So do you think um let me name some little Instagram hotties. Some um what's their name, Scotty? Oh, uh, Jada, you think Jada, you like the way Jada's dressed? Yeah, Jada, Jada, Jada. Jada, Des, and what's the other girl name? Um, Toya, she said Toya, yeah, Toya's cute. Toya always been cute to me, mm -hmm. always. Toya has always been cute. Y'all, name some people. I'm kind of, I'm, I'm, I gotta think about, I'm thinking about some lines right now. Name some people um. that y'all like style-wise. Carisha. Oh, yeah, I love, I was just about to say City Girls. I ain't gonna lie, I love the way JT dressed. But, okay, so, all right. Is is that fashion or Look, is that just designer? designer because that's dress. how I feel about designer dress. That's more so drip. I, okay. It's, it's drip it's and there's fashion. You know what I'm saying? Oh. I feel like they be more so drip out, like drip down, drip. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't think it's, yeah, more more so trendy. Like, it's not, like, timeless. It's some, they be wearing some shit that you'll look back on and be like, what the f did I have on? Right. Like, why was, I had all that shit on? Because it's with the times. All of that. Yeah, time. you just and went trendy and drip down. Like, um, I like timeless stuff. Look, since I said, but everybody can't carry the drip. Period. It be some whack motherfuckers in Okay. There. They be letting the drip carry them. <laughs> they be drowning. Uh -huh. They be drowning. You like, gotta carry the drip. Don't let the drip carry you. That's not period. that's the tip for today. We gonna come up with a right. tip. <laughs> exactly. Uh, Tracy says Sierra. I think I okay. First of all, Sierra is gold for me. Period. She Sierra was. is gold. I love her, but I don't know if she can dress. Now I do like the way Lala dressed. Lala dressed really. really now, first of all, I like Lala's upgrade. Yeah, that whole did. upgrade is just sis is the best. I, nobody, ever especially on her power. Lower. I used to love the way she dressed because she always seemed like she wore all black. I was like, she's so cute. Why don't nobody talk about her glow up though? Because Lala knew up. Oh, I guess that's huh? I said Lala be slept. I said Lala be slept on. So slept on, like her glow up is a may like immaculate. Nobody talks about it. <laughs> who, who, who Tracy talking about? Who you talking? Oh, she's talking about Sierra still her long legs be pulling a lot, pulling a lot off for her. 
she be looking ghetto. Who oh. be looking ghetto? Who? I think they're talking about Sierra. I mean, um, Lala. Lala. I know they're talking about Lala. Oh, Lala did have some jeans that came out. Damn, folks be doing stuff. You be forgetting. She did have some jeans that came out. I know. Girl, Lala. She did. did. She did. And she, I love Lala cute for me. I'm sorry. It is cute. If it's I cute. ever get work done or if I ever get anything done, like, I want to blow up the way Lala glow up. Some people be doing shit and fuck their fuck they stuff all the way up. All the way up. Mm-hmm. But I have yet to show y'all Solange. I'm still going to stand by that. How you spell her name, Solange? Let I me see, because who else do y'all think is Instagram cute? Oh, Instagram cute. That's another one. That's another. That's another. Um, Drea. Oh, you know I love the way Drea really cute? Dress. No, you know who else is really cute? Who? What's the male girl for her name? She's so cute. Who? Alain Rouge. Is that her name? Somebody told me I look like her, Scotty. Well, not somebody. A few people have told me I look like her. I don't really? see it. But I think she cute. She's just a little dry. She just seemed a little dry. I like dry. the dress. I like the way she dressed. She have a cute... Her her style is cute. We talk about style. Yeah, her style is cute. But what about Drea? I love Drea. I guess I haven't been really noticing Drea, even though I do follow her style. So I love Drea. She be looking cute. Who is Jay? And her little upgrade was Drea had a nice little upgrade too. Who is like, Jay? Huh? Rashida. Cece love no Rashida be having too much shit on. Like okay. she got everything. <laughs> look like she she looking country as hell. She look like she got everything from her boutique on and every outfit. <laughs> <laughs> Rashida be looking. <laughs> oh no, but oh, she has my Cuban doll. She's that fifty cent girl. Cece, you said what? Fifty cent girl. Uh uh. Now what? Now okay. I think I feel like I should be an image consultant because I think I should be Meg the Stallion. Yeah. Image consultant because whoever she got, I don't like. I don't like the baby <laughs> baby tops and the um, bell bottom jeans. <laughs> That made the sign be wear, and that she was selling on fashion. <laughs> I don't like it. This is like a baby she, top. She do. She be wearing them baby, baby tops. tops, not crop tops. Maybe baby baby, baby tops. tops. Like I'll be just like, girl, she's too old, and she too. She got too much money to dress like that now. You know what I'm saying? Like. <laughs> <laughs> so sorry, please dress our good sis Meg. For real. <laughs> yeah, so for me. real. It's she like, got... how she switch, I be listening to Impressive on her. She always talk about how Meg just be switching, switching, switching her um stylist. And I'm like, oh I can't. I <laughs> Tracy to... said her makeup make her look like a man. <laughs> <laughs> no, that girl is so pretty without she makeup. Is. She she is. is so pretty. But no, listen, I'm telling you, I was me and Tracy was crazy like kind of hurt because they do kind of make her look a little. We harder. were talking about that on the phone, like we were Ooh. talking about how pretty she is without makeup. But no, a lot of chicks be overdoing that shit. Like you have to understand, but drag like, queen. I don't even feel like she overdo it. It just seemed like I think she overdo it because that's only what drag queen. The way she looks, that's what. Drag she is so pretty. Her hair, she's got nice skin. She don't need none of that shit. She need to go through. You remember when Nicki Minaj went through that little natural phase where she yeah, was just crazy, and then all of a sudden she was just real natural. Yeah, she was all. And then she was natural. I was like, and then she was natural. And got I mean, the wigs, the makeup, huh? I said she didn't got her sense back. Yeah. Okay, so I pulled up some pictures of Solange. Are we still talking about Solange? Let's see. Because I'm going to stand by what I said. Y'all ain't finna roast Solange out. Y'all talking about she looking homely and... Um, if our good sis look homely and homeless. I think she be looking so good. I think she looks... I think she be looking good. 
But I write her. I don't see no cute pictures, but I know she do. You where know. the outfits at? If you know where they at. I'll be like they're little, they're little extra. They're little extra. Yeah. He's, huh? he's country too. Cardi B. She what? He said, I'll be liking Cardi. I said, no, she's country too. Cardi is more drip. That's more. No, actually, Cardi can Cardi can dress. I like the way Cardi dress. Country. I like what she dress. I think it's cute. I like the way Cardi dress. The avant garde. I prefer Nikki's avant garde than. She look like she from the back. Come on, Solange. Stands. You look like she Okay, let me see. Oh, Tracy Ellis Ross. I like the way she dressed, but that's more okay. so like how okay. I like Solange. Like and killer. No, Tracy Ellis Ross can dress. Solange cannot. <laughs> Tracy Ellis dress? Me Ellis Ross can dress. Solange cannot. Keisha Kior, uh uh. That's too much. I don't like it. I can't with Keisha at all. Keisha, too much drip. Keisha Over is ghetto. Trace said Keisha is the ghetto. <laughs> but her 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 body cute though. Now, do you think that's her real body, Scotty? Because she be talking about she, you know, waist train and she has surgery. <laughs> Definitely. She had Definitely. surgery, and then she race trained and probably worked out like hell, but she had surgery. Because of I think Cardi is a little more high-end than Keisha. Honestly. I think she's a little more high-end. All right, so... I was about to try to find... Let me see. Have y'all watched our video this week? And what's your thoughts? And what would y'all like to see? What would what what videos would y'all like to see? And what topics do y'all want us to talk about on next Wednesday? So this is our first episode. So every week we'll have different topics, but and we're gonna go live for maybe like what thirty minutes. J Lo always. Period. Who was that, Scotty? Solange. I'm just trying to figure out. <laughs> <laughs> Don't do her, Scotty. Don't do her. Okay, let's talk about guys. The way guys. Okay, let's do this and then we can end it. Right, let's talk about our fashion guys that we like. Oh, I know. Fabulous. Go. Yeah, fabulous. No. Fabulous can dress. I also like the way Drake does. I love the way Drake does. He Drake is fine. fine and pristine. Drake is girl. Drake's so damn fine. I'm like, what? He looks so handsome. He is so. I mean, it's just like that's a glow up too. That is a glow up. Oh, you know who wasn't glow up with Khalifa? Oh. I haven't paid much him much attention, but oh, let me pull up a picture of him a Jim P. Cause. Okay, so Tyra said more, maybe a video of y'all style. That's a good idea. It's a type run. My style is changing right now. What's that white boy that got that black girlfriend? Tracy, there's a lot of those. <laughs> <laughs> the fine one. Cece said Gucci Man. Okay, Cece. You? Gucci Man. Now, he did look nice on the verses. But other than that, he looked country. Where's Khalifa so fine to me? That is my type. He looked like he smells so good since I were like some linen. Who? Drake. Oh. And Ooh, the one that fought Mayweather. Oh, who? Gervonta? No, he didn't fight. She is not talking about Gervonta. I know she's not talking about Gervonta. Yes, Wiz been looking good. I think I'm going to have to go with. Wiz Khalifa is so fine to me. Really? So fine. <laughs> so fine. Oh, he fine. But I'm going to show you him now, Scotty. Because he they got his body. He's working out. They just said the white one. Ew, I know you're not talking about... Um, I don't know his name, Tracy. 
Pack it. No, they're not packing. Let me go to his name. Oh, oh. McGregor. Yeah. You said that he, you like him? Yo, Tracy. That's not Wiz Khalifa. He didn't got big. Girl, that is Wiz Khalifa. Let me see. I'm about to find another picture. Hold on. Wiz, Wiz can fucking listen. Listen. McGregor, he can dress. It's a little blurry. Okay. Can you see that? He look good. He look blessed. Uh, oh, what about Kevin Gates? We was just talking about him. Um, he's going up too. I, yeah, he's going up, but I don't think I really care for the way he dressed. Do you like the way he dressed? Oh, no, no, no. I was just talking about the glow up. Oh. I was just talking about the glow up. But, um, that's nice. Yeah. Um, let me think, guys. Can... As far as dress, I thought we were talking about dress. Are you talking about? No, I like Luca. Do you know who Luca is from Grownish? No, I don't watch Grownish. Oh, Grownish is a good show. He can, he dresses very nice. Um, Luca. Jim Jones. Jim Jones. Jim Jones is just fine to me. Period. Jim Jones is fine, and I really don't understand why him and Chrissy ain't never. That's what we should talk about next week, Scotty. What? Staying with people for like it's fabulous and um it's fabulous and Emily, Emily B married. B. I don't know. Probably not. And what's her name? Um, what's that chick name? Um, Chrissy and Jim Jones. Like, does marriage mean anything? Like, <laughs> would y'all want to talk about that next week? Well, we can. Tracy got that time. <laughs> Go soft power at this point. <laughs> it's the me. Ghost is fine, though. Ghost is fine. Yeah. Quita said, Yes, please talk about that next week. Yes. Yeah, because like right being with somebody for 20 years. Now, let me tell you, before, I'm, I'm going to say this just to give y'all a little anticipation for next episode. My cousin just got married. They've been dating for 19 years. They have three kids together. Well, you did not tell me that part. You, try to, you lied. I swear to God. You never told me that they just got married? Yes. They just got engaged. Who are you talking about? Wait, who you just say? My cousin. Oh. This is all on my daddy's side. Okay. This is on my daddy's side. Okay. So, yeah, they went to his, his wedding. My mom told me, she was telling me, I'm like, okay, so I wanted to marry. Because they've been together since I've known him. Okay, so, I, she was I, like, I, they've been together for 19 years. I said, that don't make no sense. Because, to me, it seems like he said shit. I'm, oh, they 40-something now. You know, like, he like, well, shit. This all I got now, so I'm going to marry you, like, after he had all his fun and ran his rodeo. So we can talk about that next week if y'all want to. Yeah, we, can talk about this. we were on here long just chatting. That was right. We, was on, we did not plan on being here this long. We really didn't. But this was good. Like, y'all was interacting. Thank y'all. Sorry, I had to say y'all better tune in next week. week. Are y'all going to tune in next week? Huh? I was asking if they were going to tune in next week. So, so yeah, and Sasara had a video request of us to do video about style. So I guess we could do that next time we film. Thanks, Tracy. Thank you, Tracy. So how would you describe your style, though, Scotty? I don't really know what my style is, too. I'm trying to, you know, become like Classy but grown and sexy. And I wanna I'm really dress right. fall. Like I wanna buy a nice coat. Like, but I don't have nowhere to go. But I'll be wearing these okay. little girl jackets. That's change in a minute. I'm gonna have huh? some. I said I don't be having nowhere to go. So I just feel like since I be in the house, I be just not doing nothing. So that's gonna change. So that's I'll be able to show you. you. Got it. You know what? So Tyra said, y'all should roast y'all old style. That's what we're going to do. We're going to pull up our old ass pictures from college. 
our makeup, the yeah. what we had on. We used to go to the first store out. looking like we used to wear them damn blazers and shit. Where was we going? <laughs> Where was we going? Tracy said she don't like being naked no more. <laughs> Why not, Tracy? That girl loves Talk about some hauls. Huh? CC said, talk about some hauls. What about a. Oh. Tracy. Yeah, we're going to do some hauls, definitely. Yeah. We definitely want to do some hauls. We did. Our dress used to be so short. So short. It needs to be cold. We didn't care. Did we even wear I don't even remember having a jacket back then. Did we even have a jacket? <laughs> I don't even remember a owning a jacket. I do not remember owning a jacket. It was in 31 with mini skirts on. And it's so crazy, Scotty. You know, the night that we got into a fight, That's the. I think that's the first night I ever wore jeans to the club. Really? Because I didn't want to yeah. go. I didn't even want to go. Tra okay, Tracy being too, um, what you call it, um, uh, TMI. She being too open. She said no panties, but I had a jacket. <laughs> Where is she at? Is she in Atlanta or is she in Columbus? I think she's here. Girl, it's crazy. All right, y'all. I guess we're gonna wrap it up. We know. Uh, so so of all of that. Tune in for next Monday's video. I hope y'all enjoyed it. This next is a week one down Wednesday. Wine down Wednesday. We didn't even drink the wine, Sky. Talking too much. You said, what well, time we missed you? I said, we didn't even drink the wine because we were just talking too much. I did. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. All right. Well, good night, y'all. Thank y'all for chilling with us. Bye. Bye.